mission. Thursday was a dream come true for Geneva Harrison. I am really excited because I have actually wanted to come to High Point University since sixth grade. She's getting a full ride through Say Yes Guilford worth $146,000, lifting a financial burden that stood between her and her academic potential. Just wanted to make sure that it was known, um, especially with writing my essay, that I have wanted to be here and all the different things that I want to do. So. I made sure that that was known throughout my paper. Please welcome Miss Geneva Harrison. It's an idea that thrilled families when the Say Yes program started. Then last year, the scholarship assistance program made some changes after far exceeding its budget the first year. The major change was that the income cap, $100,000. So for families that make over $100,000, for the public model, they would not necessarily receive a Say Yes award. That change didn't affect awards for students attending private colleges like HPU because the participating universities themselves contribute the scholarship money and Say Yes says changing the public university model will allow it to sustain the program for years to come. We've had a full year of the new model in effect and then as a result there are no changes for the upcoming 2018-2019 school year for the scholarship. Ensuring future students have the same opportunity for an affordable education. It's time to hit the ground running. I am very excited to show and and to everyone, not only to myself, but to everyone, that I am extraordinary. In High Point, Katie Husband, Spectrum News. CS Guilford's deadline for students to choose their schools is.